Hey everybody, uh, it is February 9th. Right now I'm done trading for the day. I'm up about 427. Uh, it was an okay trading day, pretty choppy, but um, that's not really why I'm making this video today. Uh, I want to uh, go over my chart setup and give you guys some files and instructions if you want to get your workspace to look like uh, this over here. So this is kind of the final product of what uh, yours should look like after we get done today. I'm also using this nifty uh, avatar bear guy. Let me know what you think about him in the comments if I should keep keep him or ditch him. I don't know what to think. It's just kind of fun. You can make him growl. He's, he's always kind of growling. I don't know how to make him not really growl, but that's okay. It's kind of my mood sometimes anyway when I'm trading. Um, so look, this is going to be the final product. Um, there's going to be a link in the description for the workspaces. Uh, for the workspace, there's only one workspace. And there's also going to be a folder in that zip file for the chart templates. So there's going to be two folders. One's going to call, be called workspace. The other one's going to be called uh, charts. And the workspace um, obviously is the workspace that needs to go in the workspace template. A workspace folder of the NinjaTrader 8 folder, which is typically found in your My Documents uh, folder. So if you go into My Documents, there should be a folder there called NinjaTrader 8. In that, there should be a folder uh, that's called um, that's called Workspaces. And then uh, there also should be a folder in there called, I'm going to pull it up, there should be a folder in there called, uh, let's see, Templates. So here we go. If you go into, uh, and I'm gonna go over all this in detail, Ninja Trader 8, there should be something in here called Workspaces. There also should be a folder here called Templates and then Chart. Um, that's where the chart templates are gonna go. But let's jump into how you'll actually get yours, um, your uh, workspace set up like this. So here we go. Okay guys, so what you first wanna do is you wanna click, go ahead and click on that link below uh, to actually get the files. So, Click on the link, just paste this in there. Um, you should come to a page like this. Um, you're just gonna go ahead and click the download link and that's gonna download this to your uh, downloads folder or wherever you keep your downloads folder or your downloads, I should say. Um, I've already downloaded it. So we'll just come over here. Um, you're gonna unzip it um, and put it in whatever location you, you'd like to, to have it. Um, once you've unzipped the folder, as I mentioned before, you're going to have um, a couple folders inside that file. And I can show it to you over here. Um, you're going to have the chart, a chart folder. You're going to have workspaces and there's going to be a readme, a readme file. Um, I, I would take a look at that readme file. Um, it's just basically going to go over what I, I'm, I'm telling you today or right now um, about the two folders. You're also going to need to keep in mind that um, I have three indicators um, that are only available with the um, lifetime license of NinjaTrader 8. So if you do not have the lifetime, lifetime license, these indicators, as they are saved in the template, are not going to work on your system. Um, what you can do is I've included two links for uh, free versions of these, the free cumulative delta indicator and a free VWAP indicator. So what you're going to need to do is go to these websites. Uh, again, this is in the README file. Um, download the free indicators, and then you're going to have to manually replace them in the charts. Um, so I know that's kind of a pain, but um, it's it's you know the all, the only alternative, and it, it'll take you probably five ten minutes to do it, and then you won't have to do it anymore. Um, there are, for the volume profile, there are lots. I do not know where there's a free volume profile. There are lots of um, uh, paid third-party uh, volume profiles that you can buy and sometimes they range anywhere from like a hundred to two hundred dollars and so if you're interested in a volume profile you're probably going to have to buy one however if you find a free one i'd love to hear about it and you can leave it leave a um, comment down below and uh, let other folks know what's wh where they can find that as well so you're going to unzip the folder that you just downloaded um, inside that folder let me pull it up uh, do, 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 where is it? Here it is. Um, when you unzip it, you're going to have um, the chart. If you open the chart folder, that's going to have all my chart templates. 
So you're going to have a workspace template, which is this one. It's called Futures Day Trading Workspace. That's going to be the actual workspace setup. And then within that, each chart has its own template. So we have one minute, four hour, five minute, 15 minute, 30 minute, 60 minute daily default. Default, I think, is just the volume volume template. You could you could actually not install that one if you wanted to. Tick, volume, and weekly. So to install those, all you need to do um, is go um, back over to your My Documents folder. And I'll pull this up so that I can show you exactly what I'm talking about. You can just go to My Documents and then click on, uh, so you're in Documents, Ninja Trader 8. And you're just going to look for those files. And I've got the location of those, again, in the README document that you'll download. I've put the location of where to find these. So for the chart, you would go to Documents, Ninja Trader 8, Templates, Chart. So Ninja Trader 8, Templates, Chart. And you would just copy and paste these uh, chart templates over into this folder. That will automatically put them into Ninja Trader 8. So when you load up Ninja Trader 8, Next time, these will already be preloaded in there, and you won't have to do anything, uh, anything else with them. Then we go to workspaces as well. So I have a lot of different workspaces in my folder, but the one that you're going to be copying and pasting is, is just the one that's included in the zip file, and you would just copy and paste this over into your uh, Ninja Trader 8 folder that's on your system. And so those will all then be loaded into Ninja Trader 8. Um, and you won't have to import them any other way. They'll just be ready to go once they're in there. Okay, now what you're going to do is come back. You're going to fire up Ninja Trader 8. You want to make sure that you are you do not have Ninja Ninja Trader 8 running when you copy and paste those uh, files over. I don't know if it would really make a difference or not, but you probably just uh, want to not have it running. Um, so you fire it up. Ninja Trader 8 um, and whatever you may have your own workspace up here right now. I've closed out all the workspaces. But what you would do is come into workspaces and then you should now see futures day trading workspace um, there. And what you're going to do is just click on it. And it should automatically load up all the uh, charts and um, with the indicators um, loaded again. You, you need to make sure that you've got the chart templates uh, copied and pasted over into the chart file. Um, if you don't, then these indicators won't load up properly. Uh, the, the templates won't load up properly because you don't have the chart templates um, loaded on your system. And also uh, remember the uh, VWAP, if you do not have the lifetimes license, the VWAP volume profile and cumulative delta will not work. What you'll need to do is go and download those free indicators. And then you'll need to come in here, remove the any ones that say order flow on them. Um, or the, vo the volume profile, cumulative delta and VWAP. These will not load properly because you don't have them on the system with a lifetime license. You just need to remove them by clicking the remove button, remove, remove. And then you would need to go come in here and find those free indicators that you downloaded and add them, uh, add them to the chart. You hit can't, and then you hit OK. And then you would need to save over this template by going to templates, save as, and then for instance, this is a 500, the volume one. So you would come down here to volume and then you would hit save and it's going to say, do you want to replace it? And you would say yes, because you would want to save over it with now your new free indicators. Um, that that you've downloaded. Um, this the chart layout may not be exactly the same because I think the screen size or whatever's going on, you may need to make some adjustments by just moving the charts around, um, resizing them, you know, however you want um, to make it fit your screen. I've done this where I've copied my workspace and charts over to other computers, and I sometimes have to just tweak it a little bit um, just to make it make it all fit. And that's about it, guys. Um, after that, you should have uh, this layout and the chart template and the workspace all set up. So it's pretty simple. Just make sure that you install those files. And then when you fire Ninja Trader, uh, everything should be preloaded um, for you and, and ready to go. So I hope that helps. If you have any problems with it, go ahead and just leave a comment uh, down below. And, um, you know, there may be some some issues with this uh i uh but like i said i've done this on other computers and it's, and it's worked out fine um so i'm hoping um that um, that'll be the same 
uh, for for this. So, but yeah, if you have any issues, just leave a comment, and we'll try to try to work it out. Um, and uh, yeah, this should this should work out okay for you. I hope. Uh, just trying to help you guys out by me helping out other traders. It it takes nothing away from me, and um, I hope it helps you guys with your trading. And I know a lot of people have been asking me for for this video, so. Um, let me know if you have any issues. Best of luck with your trading. Um, I'll be back tomorrow, 8, 10 a.m. with the pre-market um, analysis. I hope to see some, some of you guys there. Okay, thanks. Bye.